the universe is expanding and that means the distance between Earth, Moon and Sun should increase, but it does not. Why is that? Our universe is rapidly expanding due to the constant emergence of a new space at every point in the universe. Thus, the farthest the objects are from each other, the more space is formed between them every second, and the faster they move away from each other as a result, according to the cosmological theory. However, objects located at relatively short distances are attracted to each other strongly enough not to fly apart. The acceleration imparted to them by gravity is greater than the acceleration from the expansion of the universe, so most objects can uh, quite come together, although the expansion of the universe affects the spread of this rapprochement. So, such objects include galaxies and their clusters, as well as increasingly smaller structures in the universe. So, for example, despite the expansion of the universe, our galaxy is approaching the Andromeda galaxy. This is because our galaxy and Andromeda are attracted to each other faster than the space between them has time to expand. On the scale of planetary systems, the expansion of the universe in our time is almost imperceptible, as well as the distance between the planets, because it changes by a value that many orders of magnitude smaller than any equipment can detect. And now our universe is expanding with acceleration, and according to many cosmological forecasts, this will not change, which means that over time the expansion will become significant, both on the scale of stellar systems and even on the scale of atomic nuclei. At some point, all these structures are simply will simply be torn apart by the expansion of the universe. The cosmological scenario is called the Big Rip. At the same time, according to scientists, the Big Rip will happen in about 22 billion years. Clusters of galaxies will decay about a billion years before the Big Rip. Galaxies 60 million years before the Big Rip and planetary systems just three months before the Big Rip. As for distant measures in modern physics, they're determined through physical processes and constants independent of the expansion of the universe, so they do not change, according to cosmological theory. And this is by Hausen Wise, Vicky Verma. Please leave your comments and thank you for your support. Please support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.